August the 13th and it's 7 a.m. I am going to skate in about two hours roughly and so I wanted to wake up early and I wanted to actually work out before I left to do that. I have school tomorrow for the first time in like six months. I'm dying. I'm gonna get dressed and I'm gonna work out and I don't really know how this vlog is gonna go but I have school tomorrow so this is very authentic and realistic footage of me. This lighting is kind of crazy, but I kind of like it because it's like different than my normal videos. Anyways, I'm done working out now. Uh, I feel like this is common sense, but I'm just going to say it anyways. Normally, I would work out like at a gym and like use proper equipment and things like that. But obviously, since everything is still going on right now, I don't think that it's safe. I'm honestly just like doing my best at home and like doing workout videos and doing stuff that I know. I will talk to you guys when I get to the rink. I'm supposed to be on the ice right now. That boy be a kill the vibe, he a drag. Autobiography gon' look like a brag. Let's get to the money, I'm on PT, do they ask? Ah, okay, I need to skate. I need to skate. I already got on late. I need to skate. I can't film any more TikTok. Lighting is always important, people. If you ever want to start a channel or film a TikTok like what we are doing right now, lighting is key. So I'm back from skating and I wanted to try on my outfit that I'm gonna be wearing tomorrow for the first day of school here it is it's really not like my most favorite outfit like I don't know I just like really don't care anymore one eternity later my friend Carolyn got me a bucket hat and I've never been more in love with a person before, I don't think. She got it in yellow, because yellow is my favorite color. And it says no idea on it. I just feel very accurate to me. It's like half the time I have no idea what's going on. It's currently like 6.15 a.m. I actually planned on waking up much earlier, but I kind of realized last night that more than anything, I was gonna need my sleep. So I'm still kind of nervous about today. You know, cause it's the first day and everything, and none of my friends are gonna be there, or none of my close friends are gonna be there, and so like that's not gonna be fun. But you know what? Like I'll make do. I'll figure it out. It'll be the way it's gonna be. Um, and there's really just no point in worrying about it at this point because there's nothing I can do to change it. Um, I am not going to film at school, which originally I thought about getting some clips. Now that I'm going today, <laughs> I'm like, um, no, not yet. I just don't really want to do that. One eternity later. Hello, friends. So, real quick, I'm going to sit and uh, we're going to talk about how today went. Today was really weird. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and say it. It wasn't as bad as I had expected it to be, but it still wasn't the best. I feel like I hardly saw anyone that I knew and that was really stressful, but 
I really like all my teachers. Uh, I'm really excited to take some of the classes that I'm taking. I learned something today in French one. Je m'appelle Madeline. Very proud of that, I've already picked that up. That's cool. Yeah, I don't know, man, I just feel weird. I'm going to go to Sprouts really quickly and I'm going to pick up some vegan gummy bears for a video that I'm gonna be filming soon about veganism. And yeah, I'm just gonna go grab that. I wanted to add something to what I said earlier. I am not with my normal group of people that I would normally eat lunch with and normally like do things with, however, this whole like predicament i guess has like really forced me to i say force as if it's like been a bad thing it's been a great thing it made me talk to people that i normally wouldn't talk to as much at school so that was really good i feel like i feel like that was the really positive thing looking for me to let's go take me on this journey home i don't want to wait no. literally this old man saw me vlogging that clip where I picked up the gummy bears <laughs> and he was like, he seemed so offended. I'm like, I'm not filming you, I'm filming the gummy bears. I don't know, it just kind of made me laugh. Anyways, I got the gummy bears and I'm not gonna film the video today, but I have the gummy bears, which is step one. Hello, so this is a brief segment that I'm gonna now call in my vlogs, what I got for my room off of the internet. That was stupid. I bought a few new things um, for my room because I'm constantly wanting to change my room and I cannot decide on an aesthetic or what I like. So here we are. Everything's just kind of like a collage. Also, I like shut my blinds because literally it is so bright outside. It was so nice and foggy this morning and I was loving it. I honestly wish that I brought my camera so I could show you guys like what the mountains looks like and everything because it was so nice and foggy. So now that I can light candles up in my room, I actually bought these Himalayan salt candles, which are gonna be really fun. I just put these candles from Walmart into here because these do not come with the like, these are like candle holders technically, and then you know, we have the actual candles. I use my Himalayan salt lamp so much, like I use it every single day, and so I figured it would be really nice to have something very similar, but with candles, because now I have an addiction. Also, my lamp, my desk lamp over here, the like tall silver skinny one that was sitting here for the longest time actually broke. And so I've been having to use this nightstand lamp is kind of what they're calling it. I got it from Urban Outfitters way, way, way long time ago before I stopped shopping there. It's very, very harsh on the eyes and it's just not a good desk lamp. I really like how it looks like with the rest of my like desk. I actually redid my desk if you can't tell. Um, so I really like how it looks, but it's just not very practical in my opinion. So I went on Amazon and found this baby on sale for like $10. And I really like it because it has this like wooden look to it. I mean, it, it is wood. So I like it because it's not white. So it adds some like color to my room. And it still does keep with the white theme though because it has this white base. It's really cute. And you turn it on and off with this thingy, but I don't know how that works yet. So. I'm gonna set it up. Hi, this is totally random. I still haven't set my lamp up yet. I've been procrastinating, but I saw this thingy on Snapchat. You take a quiz and it tells you who your vampire boyfriend will be from like the Vampire Diaries or like Twilight. And I just got finished watching Twilight with Claire, like the whole series. And so I got Stefan Salvatore. <laughs> I don't know what that says about me, but anyways, um, I'm gonna set up this lamp now, and I really will let you guys know how it goes. Okay, folks, here we have her. She's all set up. Like, light itself is very white, which I'm not the biggest fan of. It's fine for studying, and that's really what I need it for. Whoa, it's very bright, and I'm gonna have to figure out how to fix that, because it's hurting my eyes. You can take my eyes if you need to 
They're always looking for you. Another branch offered for the pyre. Hello. So I know this is kind of a big change in scenery. I made a last minute decision to come up to my grandparents' lake house for the weekend, even though it's 4.55 on a Saturday. So I'm not gonna be here for too long, but I just felt like I wanted to leave and, and get away, even though I'm not getting that far away. I'm really, really happy to be here. It is just a really happy place for me. So I am planning on filming some videos when I'm up here. I have two videos in mind that I wanna film. So we'll see if that actually gets done or not. It really is nice though with my schedule with school. Because I'm only going two days a week, I can take little trips like this, which is really nice. I'm really, really tired. One eternity later. Normally, I don't film outros for my vlogs, but I figured since I'm in such a beautiful location, I should. I feel like I'm really zoomed in. So, I just wanted to say thank you all so much for watching this vlog. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! Won't you tell me I look pretty Like the first day that you met me And kiss me one more